One of my favorite things about Vashon is it's kind of a make your own adventure kind of place. A mayor who likes to bark out orders, colorful doors leading nowhere, and knick-knack collections sold by weight. Tara Morgan, a barber who makes house calls on the island, is taking me on what she calls the Vashon Unexpected Tour. This is a tour of things that I've discovered and things that are sort of unexpected. Our first stop is the Country Store and Farm. For nearly 60 years, they've been selling homemade honey, toys, and clothes. We really try and, and carry a good brand, but also something that's kind of fun. Tara sizes me up for a so-called Vashon tuxedo. Oh, you look super snappy. I like it with the plaid. Apparently, you need Blundstone boots for the whole look. I did not know that this farm was back here until like six months ago. Back behind the store, Adria McGrath cultivates an organic farm where she grows pumpkins and Instagram-worthy bean teepees. In downtown Vashon, we stop at Cafe Vino Olio. I can't wait for you to try this place. It's not just coffee, it's the best bagels on the island. The coffee is great, the egg sandwich is scrumptious, but owner Jane Norton has made local art the star of the dining area. People come in and eat and drink and sometimes buy art, which is great. This island is home to many artists, which explains the Osborne family doors. It's everything pop culture and movies. You've got Napoleon Dynamite, remember right. the lockers right. from yeah. Napoleon Dynamite, uh, Sandlot, Doctor Who, and this is actually from Friends, the sitcom. Oh. And speaking of Friends, that is some breath. That is Buddy the Bulldog, voted unofficial mayor of Vashon. He's full of ideas, he's <laughs> engaging, but very calming to be around. Looking for anything from a sailfish to a suitcase? Our final stop is Vashon Estate Sales. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> you've, hit, you've basically hit the jackpot here. But the true treasure is in a side room called the Artist Apothecary. The artist being Mike Urban, who owns the place. This is a culmination of 20 years of collecting, and you can see from wall to wall, jars and jars of everything, and you know a lot of people don't know about this place who even live on Vashon Island. Most people love the familiarity of the place they call home, but Tara Morgan loves the unexpected gems she finds on Vashon Island. It's cool, huh?